You know, I think what's most important to any buyer, domestic or international, we are here 365 days a year. Welcome to the USA Dry Pea and Lentil Council 2020 Harvest Tour. U.S. Pulse production is like no other. It uses an integrated approach to bring quality and consistency to you. The process begins by investing in research and seed development to create the pulse varieties with the characteristics you need in your market. Our growers are the best in the world and they take pride in providing the safest and healthiest dry peas, lentils, and chickpeas. American Pulse Farmers are wonderful. They're trying to do their best for the pulse industry, um, and they're willing to invest in the research and extension that's needed to get them the information that they want. In addition to our research efforts, our environments in the Pacific Northwest, Northern Plains, and emerging production areas have a unique climate that produces very high quality year after year. Farming isn't always fun, and it's not always glamorous, and it's not always glorious, but I will tell you that the, the American farmer does everything they possibly can to make a product that we're proud to send overseas, we're proud to put in a bag that's got the USA stamped all over it. The U.S. pulse industry has invested millions of dollars in pulse processing facilities. The whole system is focused on quality control. The U.S. uses a unique quality control system in partnership with the U.S. government, the Federal Grain Inspection Service, that provides third-party verification of the quality and integrity of each lot. We can trace the product back to the field. We have a very stringent system in place. I have a quality control that samples in the line every two to three hours, plus samples the product once it's in the package. So we know our quality. The customer knows what they want. I think quality obviously is the, the biggest thing. And I, I think our quality is unsurpassed. Farming has been in, in my blood, man, it's a hundred years now. The family part of farming is so important. There's so much knowledge and there's so much we can learn from our elders and how to take care of the ground, how to grow a quality crop. Well, we're actually about a stone's throw away from the Montana line, right on the Montana North Dakota border. This is a third generation uh, cattle operation and also farm. So we're about nine miles southeast of Genesee, Idaho. My three sons and I, and we've been here a long time, since 1909. We're in northeast Montana. Pea and lentil harvest we completed about two weeks ago. My great grandfather homesteaded in 1909. For me, this is paradise. The Mater Farm is a fifth generation farm. We farm wheat, chickpeas, pardina lentils, and whole green peas. The Golden Triangle is a, it's an interesting area because we have a climate that's like no other. The U.S. pulse industry has earned its reputation for having the best environment for growing pulses. Whether it's in the hills of the Palouse or the plains of the northern high country, our growers know their land better than anyone. They have worked the fields and soils for generations. The farmer's knowledge produces a better crop. These pulses are not easy to grow, and only the best farmers can produce the best crops. Our weather really cooperates with us. We, we get most of our moisture in the spring growing season. We get these good dry Augusts and Septembers that uh, we don't get rain on, and I think it helps with our quality. Farmers around here are pretty resilient, and we do 100% cropping rotation. The cool weather, the timing of precipitation, um, allows us to raise absolutely a premium product, low disease. U.S. Pulse growers raise a variety of high-quality dry peas, lentils, and chickpeas. We set the standard for quality. It starts on our farms and continues on every step of the way to the country elevator and processor, exporter, and shipment to your destination. 
Production and food safety records are maintained at each step. Safety, um, it starts from the day we start growing it. Consumers have to be able to trust our product and we do all we can to make sure that happens. We're Food Alliance certified here, which means we allow people to come in and look at our records and see what we do everything right. I think that's, I think food safety in the last seven, eight years is, is we're aware of it every day. We are a, a large, large country, um, a large growing area. Somewhere in the U.S. that premium product is available. The American market is open 365 days a year. We have to do what we can to make sure that the consumer wants our products. In the U.S., farmers are using some of the best technology and research available to raise the highest quality pulses in the world. Public and private research helps the farmers find the best varieties and the best growing practices. Without the research, we can't have varieties that are uh, basically tuned for our area. So uh, we've been raising a lot of the same varieties for a long time, but the newer varieties are coming out. They're better yielding, they're more resilient, um, they're better tuned for our weather. So objectives for the breeding program on the peas is, first of all, uh, agronomic adaptation. Do they grow? How, how do they yield? Uh, for the growers' perspective and for their interests, uh, are they harvestable? Uh, are they going to be upright? Public and private researchers are making continued scientific progress to improve yield and product and use functionality. Customers care about having a clean crop because they don't want new pests or diseases in their own country, and we don't want them here either. We should all be working together to help provide the cleanest, and, and we do here in the United States. We have a very arid environment, and we do not have many disease issues. Pretty much every processor's process is the same. It starts here. This is just bulk receiving where we're storing the raw product out of the, from the farm. And inside it just goes through a multiple stage cleaning process until we get to the end of the line. And you know we're constantly checking the quality of the lentil, especially before we put it in a bag to ensure that it's good enough to bag and send to our customers. From the beginning of the process, we're doing everything we can to maximize the quality of product that we, that we send out. We like to follow our products from the point where they are produced all the way until they meet our end-use customer. The U.S. pulse industry is committed to producing and supplying the world with the best quality dry peas, lentils, and chickpeas. Our processors work to ensure that what you order, you receive. Processors in the United States work with the buyers at a close level to determine what exactly they want to see in the bag. Well, we have to know exactly what the buyer's expectations are. Some of it is just absolutely perfect, and so that's what they demand. Uh, we have a full line of cleaning equipment, including size graders, density graders, color sorters, um, precision graders for sizing in crops like chickpeas where that's necessary. We have everything in line to ensure that we're delivering the quality of product that our customers expect and, and that they deserve. This is actually the Bronick. So it's a smaller variety, 7-8 mix. That's what they look like when they're done. We have all the equipment that is necessary in order to have SPF level 2. Uh, infrared, metal detection, your, whole, your full gamut of, of state-of-the-art food cleaning. Uh, grain cleaning technology. We know exactly which package, which one of these packages came off of which field, and we can trace that back if necessary. The goal in the end is to have the highest quality product possible consistently. So I think the important thing is that we all listen to the customers. We try to contract very specifically. The customer can be reassured that what they're receiving is what was in that contract. very high standards for everything that we do, whether it's uh, our pulses or our grains. We pride ourselves on having very high standards so that um, there's not a question when it gets to the buyer. 
The Federal Sampling, Inspection and Certification Standard set us apart from the rest of the world. No matter where the crop is grown in the USA, our standards are the same on the farm, at the processor, at the port, and at your destination. No matter where that, that grade's being done, the customers, whether it's domestic or foreign, are getting the same grade. Um, they're getting the same standards uh, wherever it is. I'm Tim McGreevy, CEO of the USA Dry Pea and Lentil Council. I would like to thank you for joining us on this 2020 virtual crop tour. In the United States, we call this harvest in the bin. It's been quite an amazing year. And frankly, the peas, lentils, and chickpeas don't know it's a global pandemic. It's been fantastic for them. In fact, we had fantastic growing conditions in almost all of our growing regions. We had good moisture during the spring, very few diseases and insects, and frankly, the harvest was fantastic. Dry weather throughout the entire time. So 2020 is shaping up to have excellent yields and some of the highest quality that we've ever had. So it's time to contact your supplier and lock in those buys of 2020 Crop U.S. dry peas, lentils, and chickpeas. We may be virtual this year, but we hope to be with you again in 2021. Even though we are virtual, please reach out to all of our regional representatives all around the world for any questions that you have about dry peas, lentils, and chickpeas in the United States. They can help you out. And also reach out to our suppliers. They'll service you with the most consistent and high quality pulses that you can buy in the entire world. So on behalf of the entire pulse industry in the United States, we wish you the very best.